Welcome back to Let's Play Medieval Remake with Savage Smith. Alright, so last time I stopped at this angel statue just because I didn't want to record too much if the beginning wasn't recorded correctly, so I just wanted to check. And it's fine. Um, so yeah, we're moving this way. so amazing, I, I don't know, it's, it just brings you right back, and I never even got to play the full game, it was just the demo, I got the demo in a stuffed crust pizza from Pizza Hut, uh, you know, thing they were doing, some sort of special when this game first came out, and uh, me and my siblings, my brother and sister, they, we all three just played the crap out of the demo, and it was just this level over and over and over again. Oh, sweet. Alright. Yeah, just over and over. Okay, it says the chalice is at 100%. Oh, I can't get up there, though. How do I go back? Probably figure it out right now. Where the hell? Oh. Okay, here's a skull door. Cool. Oh, here's the here's the angel. Here's the chalice. Got that. Alright, let's go back. Now I can finish the level if I want. Cool. Seems like you have to get them to hit past you if you don't want to get hit at least once. It's kind of hard to do though sometimes. I like knocking out these gravestones. I wonder if you're if you're supposed to or something. Like if later on they ask me to do to knock as many gravestones as possible or something. I don't know. They break so satisfied. Still not really um, killing me though. Especially since I keep fighting these health things. And I got two health bottles now, so. I still don't know what they do though. I don't remember. Feel free to have a paddle in the shallow water. But don't be tempted to go for a swim. Buoyancy can be a problem for those of a dead disposition. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Yeah, okay. So, pretty much don't drown. This is the end of the level. Right. Tread softly. Zarek awaits beyond these gates. The master meets with the demon from the mausoleum, hatching plots of purest evil. Forgotten oh, no. nobodies would be wise to make themselves scarce. Yeah, forgotten nobodies, huh? Alright. Screw you, gargoyle. Let's go. Oh, yeah, the Hall of Heroes. Forgot in between each level you go to this place and um, this is what the the chalices are collected for. Welcome to the Hall of Heroes, where the bravest warriors from history spend eternity feasting, singing, and arm wrestling. <laughs> and arm if wrestling. they think you're worthy enough, you may be able to persuade them to give you a new weapon. Yep. I would like a new weapon, so 
I hope they do. To pay homage to the heroes, stand in front of their designated statues and await spiritual guidance. To pay homage, douchebag. Female douchebag. Captain Fortescue, <laughs> it's me, Canny Tim. Does the battle go well? <laughs> How I wish I could fight at your side again, sir. But hold, you could take my crossbow. It's got rapid fire and you can ricochet the darts off walls to shoot around corners. I used it at the Battle of Galamir. Pretty After sure these slay, are I the shot same. Zarek's champion, Lord Kardar, a clean kill through the eye at some thousand yards. The same voice lines as the same about as the shooting someone in the eye, sir. PS1 game. Oh, goodbye, sir. Oh, awesome. Got a crossbow for the first chalice. See? What's going on over here? Only when you are truly worthy as a hero will you be able to ascend to the higher level of this hall. When you have paid homage to all of the heroes in the lower hall, the ghostly stairs will then become solid. Oh, <laughs> wah, wah. that didn't work. Um, hmm, it's pretty cool though. So I guess I gotta get a certain amount of chalices or something. Uh, full up right now. Let's do this. Yup, the Hall of Heroes. According to who, I wonder. That Candy Tim guy seemed kind of like a weenie, so just curious. Um, so I came from the right over there and went left. Let me see. Yeah, just the check mark. This one I got the chalice. So up. Cemetery Hill. haven't gotten the chalice because I haven't played it yet. Sweet. Let's do this. Ugh. I hate static loading screens. It's not too bad in this game because they don't take too long, but, you know, in this day and age, just putting a picture and a loading symbol is kind of ridiculous. So, even from the shackles of death, my old enemy pursues me. You're too late, Fortescue. Already my army has risen from the grave. You will never leave this necropolis. <laughs> Graphics, it looks so great compared to the first game. I know that was three PlayStations ago or whatever, three generations ago, but still amazing. Oh, I can't even. Oh, I can move now. Is my head backwards? Yeah, my head's backwards pretty much. Like exorcist. Alright. Did you just turn it sideways? It literally does nothing. Nothing different. But he turns it sideways Some like, obstructions like a gangster. can be smashed down with clubs and certain other weapons. Try experimenting. Okay, with smashing? Don't mind if I do. That's my favorite kind of experimentation. Smashing shit. Let's see, you can it sideways. Normal. Yeah, there's literally no difference. There's, he just holds it sideways. <clears throat> These boulders are going to crush your bones if you aren't careful. I hope you have a good shield equipped. 
Remember that each hit on your shield will chip away at its durability. <sighs> Better it than you, though. Option. I just feel like I will always do the secondary fire, which is sideways. Wait. Oh yeah, both, both ricochet too. Energy vial, not bottle. Hmm. Thanks. So the vials, I don't know, refill your health a little bit, and maybe the bottles refill your health more, or all the way, or something. But they get used immediately, it looks like. It's hard to get hit when you're using ranged weapons, though. Of great archaeological interest. Destroy the boulder and plunder the valuable treasures within. Okay. Hey, okay. what the? Like a like a honeydew melon with a smiley face and a sailor hat, or like a pirate captain hat. Oh wait, almost got it. Oh, 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 oh! What is that? I have no idea what that is. What happens if I hit it? like it's something I need to do, but well, what could it mean? <laughs> no, nothing. How do I find someone to smash that open? something to smash it open. Ah. 
Ow. It's a crude but effective weapon. Bash with it, burn with it, but beware, one bash too many, and it will break. So confused. Where where is the club? Alright. So it was over here where I said I had to bash to get in. I really had to bash to get out. See what's over here now. That's just a merchant one. Yeah, it's exactly the same thing. Maybe one was automatic and the other wasn't, but um, no, you still. What do I do? I think I know what to do. Wait, how do I get out? Is it right here? You're supposed to like smash him or something. Hmm. Weird. Ooh, sweet. Let's go. I know what to do for sure now. Hurry. Really? Oh, that was bullcrap. Wait, can I get it off the wall? Why not? It's a torch on the wall. Why is it? Never mind. I know why not. So you do pain the end. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. The chalice, so I'm ready to go now. Oh, sweet, and it filled up that other one. Oh, what is that for? Sweet. Okay. Okay, let me get comfortable real quick. Alright, now I should make my way up the hill, I guess. Let me. Maybe I should just save the club. Yeah, let me see something. <laughs> ah, fresh air. We hate these dark old caves oh. and their filthy stench of old witches. 
A coven of the warty old hags lived here once, unholy fires burning all night while they brewed up unspeakable muck in their cauldrons. They moved on years back, but the smell still makes our eyes sting. <coughs> <coughs> hmm, excuse me. Oh, I thought he was a merchant one because he didn't automatically talk to me. But what am I supposed to do then? With that witch's talisman, I mean, I don't. I have no idea. The adventurer would be wise to be thorough in the exploration of an area. Hidden locations bring yeah. great rewards. I know, I was already there. Those only filled up your health, but they fill up your life bottles too. So it looked like earlier, like my health got all the way to zero and then it filled back up after it used a life bottle. So I think those are like an entire life almost. That's pretty awesome. You got something to say this time? Yeah. Back from the battle so soon? Mm, it must be a hero open. by now. But only a true hero is worthy of a place in the Hall of Heroes. Yeah, I've gone See to chalices, the ghostly I know. statue of your fraudster self? When it has turned solid, a true hero you will be. Says who, you? of the evil dead to throw your strides up. I have something that may help you on your quest, Captain. I give it to you freely, though I have no idea what it is. Oh, sweet. It's like I have four lives now. All right. Cool. I'm ready to go. Let's do it. See how it didn't take too long. Literally, I couldn't even read it. Oh, that's awesome. Wish I could look at it closer, but... I like how the overworld map or whatever has a pretty decent representation of the level. It's like the whole level right there. That's so awesome. We put a lot of effort into this. Alright, and that's the third chalice. I need to get that. Sweet, let's do this. Just dying to meet you. Don't keep him waiting. He's got a heart of glass. Okay. You are entering a house of pain. <laughs> Rumors abound of evil doings in the secret catacombs below this very hall. You're entering a world of pain. 
Smokey, you mark that frame at eight. You're entering a world of pain. A world of pain. You're entering a house of pain. Rumors abound of evil doings in the secret catacombs below this very hall. Ooh, thanks for telling me about stuff being below this very hall. <laughs> Dobby's getting very hot. What are they? He's a little pinky. He's more like, uh. He's less like Dobby and more like Piglet from. from when you go. Where are you going? Hey, Piglet. Okay, let me get the. Oops. Maybe it's smarter to keep the club out that way in case there's like something I need to smash. So I guess my shield is interchangeable, not the club. This was made for kids though for PS in the PS1 era, so Well, I mean kind of. It's kinda of horror y though, you know. Watch out for sticky fingered imps. These things uh, will strip imps. you down to your armored undies. Rumor has it they fence their stolen wares with the merchant gargoyles. Oh, these bastards. So they steal steal my throwing knives and then I buy them back from the people they sell them to? It's messed up. They're like little piggies. Alright. I should get the crossbow back now. I'm trying not to get my stuff stolen. I wonder if it tells you. sword as I was hitting him with it. It's pretty crazy. Little bastard piggy. What is this? The stained glass demon is the master of the mausoleum. His wretched soul lies preserved stained inside glass a frozen demon. glass heart. Shrouded in a veil of darkness beneath the mausoleum, you will find this pre-frozen menace. I mean... He's made out of glass, right? Why is that? I mean, I know glass is sharp or whatever, but it's also easy to smash. So, why is that something to worry about? You know, he's a demon, sure, but a glass demon? You need to throw a rock at him, he's dead. You know, some misunderstanding this here. But it seems pretty, uh, self self explainable moon room moon room moon room moon room what's this guy what's this guy's deal the would be phantom longs to play a new tune but he seems doomed to repeat the same cause of despair over and over okay 
guessing I have to find something. So those are energy vials, but I have full health, so I'm just gonna leave them there. Um, yeah, let me... And I'll just get my club out if I have to. Club, or does it just give me a hundred percent? Wait. Boy. Good thing, because I wanted to come back over. So I was supposed to come in. I didn't even realize that I needed it. Oh yeah, I haven't even gotten a challenge yet. Alright, I just now killed enough people to even make it appear, so that's good. Oh, shoot, dude. Okay, where was that guy? Ah! Those both collapsed, so I go this way. Drop down. Okay, where's the chalice? Do you give me the chalice? <laughs> yep, that's what you have to do. Oh, and he does give me the challenge. Sweet. There's three chalices already. Oh, okay. I don't think you do anything. So... What exactly do I do now? This way? PS1 games were like this though, you know, you get a color-coded key and put it in some sort of slot, like, there's this one game I used to play a lot called Rascal, and I, I've seen it on the uh, worst game ever list a lot of places, which is kind of heartbreaking, I used to love that game, even though it was real bullshit with uh, the early days of 3D and platforming. Yeah, there's a lot of that. Find color-coded stuff and little upgrades for your weapons and all this stuff. So that just reminded me of it. So, where do I go now? Oh. Alright. Go to the 
shining ball of cos cosmic energy. Let's do this. It's an awesome stained glass window, by the way. Oh, great. You guys can hear the stained glass demon? Yeah, it looks like you just throw a rock at him. He's made out of glass. It's his only vulnerable point. He's made of glass. What do you mean? Ow. Grab that head. What is that? Ah, I'm guessing the skull key goes to the skull door. Let's go see what we get for this chalice. The Hall of Heroes. It's the Hall of Heroes shopping mall. Bargain hunters should check out the ground floor. Well-to-do shoppers should check out the upper floor. That's where it's at. <coughs> okay. Okay, I'll wait till I need it. Oh no, 50 of them. I'll wait till I need 50. Ah, Fortescue! What's this I hear about that Archcad Zarog still being alive? Thought you killed the fella! <laughs> Never mind, you old warhorse! Better show him what's what, eh? Give me I that expect club. Johnny Zombie's a bit more of a handful than you remember! How are you doing for weapons? Or the bottle. The life bottle or the club yeah. that you're holding. Take my war yep. hammer. Sweet. It'll smash anything and it won't fall apart like a club. Sweet. I so it's an unbreakable club. Around this place. <laughs> Nonsense, Fortescue. I won't take no for an answer. Knock <laughs> a few heads for old stand your iron hewer, eh? Trust me, I would not say no. Give me that thing that would, I probably can't even carry. If that was really Oh yeah, definitely not with one hand. Look at this thing. That thing was solid metal. There's no way you would carry it like that. There's no way. There's no way. That thing would be like 400 pounds. Probably weigh as much as the engine block since it's a solid piece of a... You know, like steel or whatever. Alright, I'm going to end this video here and come back we'll start the fourth level or or go back to the skull gate i'm not sure what i have to do next but um i guess we'll see so if you haven't subscribed yet please do so it'll help me out immensely and like comment and share as much as possible
Thank you, and I'll see you in the next video. Savage out.